ex-judge Rose, you know, the emergency manager. And I don't know why so many people give him a lot of respect that he does not deserve. He is an ex-judge on the lowest level of the, of the federal court system, bankruptcy, and he was the lowest level in the bankruptcy judge. You know, he, obviously he's incompetent. He, he admits that himself. But I was deeply offended, and don't get me wrong, I have a great deal of respect for Tom Peloni. But how in the hell this white man gonna come in here and only listen to a white man? I mean, God, it's called superiority. I mean, where are we at? Is this 1954? Do we have to go back to Brown versus the Board of Education? I mean, I mean, we cannot and should not allow criminals to tell people they're gonna do whatever they want to do. And it was obvious to anyone listening had the emergency managers been listening to the, elect the duly elected school board, millions of dollars could have been saved. Thank you. You know, it wouldn't have been so much debt. You know, and this same little person, Rhodes, gave a whole bunch of kudos, you know, support for uh, Kevin, uh, Kevin Orr because he met regular and talked with the city council and the mayor. You know, so, but he was not going to meet with this elected school board that the people of the city of Detroit elected until a white man from outside the city of Detroit asked him about meeting with him. I was offended, and I'm still offended, and I think we all should be standing up and fighting and say that we do not want DPS dissolved. We do not want, you know, any additional outside control that any other district, if they was white, had. You know, we, all of us here need to fight what's going on here any and everywhere we can. That's all I'm going to say for now.